20th. Uh, top of the outgoing tide. The winds are out of the south, right? South, southeast. South, southeast at less than 10? Seven. Seven. It's supposed to be seven. First uh, shrimping trip of 2022. North side of the bay at an undisclosed location. through that it got mushy all right so I'm just gonna let the boat drift me and you put poles on where's me that was number one Is this the old one? Yep. Is that why it smells so good? Mmm. Three to one. Mm -hmm. Nah, I'm good. Is that penicillin I see? How many you want to start? Uh, let's do two a pole. And we're going on sunset side of the pole? Uh, when we run it, but now I'll probably just go up. No, I'm bait though. It's up to you. Whew, that stuff's right. Mm. We want to make put it all out. <laughs> How many are there? 25? Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 12, 24, maybe about 28 of them. They'll do three until we run out, and then we'll use the other. That don't get the shrimp. Woo! Sounds like a construction site porta potty. Which may be a cotton.
a little. Thing in there. Well, okay. <laughs> what was that thing in old Red Lobster? Admiral's Feast. Conditions aren't bad. Have people got work in the morning or something? My garage doors open, they'll leave things in the garage and I don't even know they're there. Not at all. No, not for that cruddy toss I just threw. And uh I'm thinking is let's see it's almost nine o'clock it'll be nine o'clock by the time we finish this run low tide was at five it's four so yeah if we're two hours out from low two and a half maybe put two balls on every pole we've yeah. only used one right we had 60 two more we still have to have a half of them left 
Okay, did you put any of that old bay in these balls? Old bay. Season them from the inside out? Yeah. But well, you, if you do that, if you put old bay in the balls, you don't have to season the shrimp with you. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> you got to pre-season it. Jump in? I think he jumped in the boat. No. He's in the bucket now. Kamikaze shrimp. that many every pole. All right, well, it was about a half a cooler tonight once we uh, take these ice pack things out and drain the water. Um, size on them are, they're, they're a good size. They just weren't really out there tonight. Um, we used some old bait binder balls from last season that we had frozen. And we put some new ones in just to see if that would make a difference. Really didn't make that big of a difference. Um, I mean, great night though. Like, literally like no wind. Barely any wind. Tide was moving nice and easy. I mean, we were down in about two and a half to three feet of water at low tide. Could see them popping around, but just not plentiful like we had seen last year yet. Um... I know we had a good bit of rain prior to this. Uh, let's see what today was the 20th of September. Um, so maybe we might go back out on Saturday here and give it a shot on my birthday. But anyway, half a cooler is not bad. I mean, they definitely have some good, good size to them here. So <clears throat> not bad on the size at all, but. It was still nice, good night out there. Had fun, always fun going out catching shrimp. So anyway, um, half a cooler is better than no shrimp. I, I probably threw out for about 12 to 14 runs of the poles, but we finally around midnight just kind of stopped for the night because we just weren't seeing piles of shrimp coming in and I mean I was throwing great pancakes tonight over the over the bait so anyway we'll give it another shot the next time here but anyway time to pop heads tomorrow pop them heads off those shrimps <laughs> 